hello everyone welcome back to my 4 c euphoria it's been a long time i know uh busy with school but i'm glad that it's summer school is over for what three months now um i have this hairstyle that i would love to share with you guys it's really really easy to attain and it's a summer hairstyle wedding summer works right if you guys want to see this please stay tuned and enjoy the video so first things first I separated my hair into three sections um, the back part the middle part and the front section the front section so what I did was I made sure that I secured all three parts in a very tight ponytail scrunchy so make sure it's holding it very well and it's not loose here I did I think three times I secured it three times yep so you can see how tight it goes and then I secured the front as well so let's deal with the back first I put the back into a bun and honestly you can choose however you want to do your bun you could do a low bun you could do a donut sock bun whatever kind of bun you want to do but I wasn't really trying to impress anyone with my bun so I just pretty much tucked it in and wrapped it around itself and I kind of made sure that it was round it felt round enough and I was good with that it's not it's not it doesn't need to be ceremonial but a bun simple bun would do and now to the second middle section I divided it into four parts and I just twist it down kind of like semi loose twists all the way down and here I stretched my hair with the African threading method so my hair is a little bit stretched out so you can see it's easy for me to just separate and twist down Now that we have four twists, I separate in the middle two to the left and two to the right. So what you want to do is you want to tuck your twist under your bun and use bobby pin if you have to. What I just did was I just wrapped mine around my bun and it stayed just fine. So I wrapped the two on the right under and then the one the two on the left I wrapped it under as well and just made sure that it was well tucked in and secured around my bun so it doesn't come off and I tried to make sure that my twists are kind of well separated but still close together so now to the front what you want to do is you want to make sure that you roll your um, your hair and then tuck it inside your ponytail just like that and make sure you're pulling all the hair at once pull it out as you tuck it in so that helps your hair stay flat so what you want to do after that is you want to separate your hair into two and do loose twist as well And here you just want to create sort of like a bang look to shape your face so depending on how you want it how low you want it or how high you want it um, secure it with a bobby pin towards the bun or towards uh, depending on how long your hair is towards your twists just make sure it's secure where it's not coming towards your face and falling down so here I'm gonna try to show you guys a 360 of what it looks like and 
and here is a neat trick that I do or I use when I don't have accessories but I know here I have a headband but I don't want to wear the headband so you just tuck in the elastic part under the band and you use safety pin to secure it on whatever side you want to showcase your headband or your accessories I decided to show it on the part where I have most of my hair like flowing towards so you secure at the top and you can secure the middle as well but I didn't think I needed to make it really tight I thought it was nice the way it kind of fell for itself so I secured in the front and I secured in the back and you can do this with almost any kind of flowery headband you have at home. It makes it a little bit more elegant. Voila! There you have it. You can wear this honestly casually or you can wear it to a summer wedding. I actually plan on wearing this to a summer wedding. It's quick. It takes less than... 10 minutes to get this look thank you so much guys for watching and thank you for supporting we welcome new subscribers please continue to like comment and subscribe